What I want to say about that is God has constantly reinforced his covenant about his people. He promises to protect, to provide, to keep us settled and peaceful, to be with us, never to leave us or abandon us, to help us at every turn, to hide us in his pavilion, in the secret of his pavilion. So, I want you to be encouraged because you are the people of God, called by his name, called out of darkness and delivered from shame. One holy race, saints everyone, because of the blood of Christ, Jesus the Son. You have no reason to fear. You have no reason to panic. God is going to do both things. As Jeanette said, as I said 20 years ago, there will be a paradox going on. One road will be loaded with disaster, judgment, catastrophe, death, sickness, curses, worries, fears, loss, while the other pathway will be loaded with blessings, provision, answer prayer, very present help, healing, deliverance, blessings. So all I say to you is choose which way you will go because your choice will determine what happens in your life. And your choice is not just, Lord, forgive me for sin and fill me with your Holy Spirit. That's at the starting point. You got a pathway ahead of you. That's where you make your choices. Your choices will determine if you turn left, if you turn to the right, if you halter, if you digress, and go backwards if you regress, if you progress, if you grow, if you don't, if you learn, if you refuse instruction, you, your choices from moment to moment will determine the outcome that goes on. When all hell is breaking loose, God knows how to bring heaven right here on earth right into your life if you make the right choices every chance you get. We're not perfect. We never will be. But we should be found trying our best. And that's all I have to say. Be encouraged. Don't allow all of that's coming worry you, trouble you, unsettle you, disturb your peace. Don't let that happen because God's got you and God's got me. So we're good. It's those that don't know, those that can't make up their minds, those that are straddling the fence, those that are in one minute and out the other. They're the ones that have a lot to worry about. God knows how to move you away from destruction when it comes. He knows how to warn you in the middle of the night, just like he warned Joseph and Mary to leave because they were getting ready to kill all the babies. Mm -hmm. He knows how to protect us, y'all. So be encouraged. We serve a risen Savior. He's in the world today. God bless you.